Hello to you, my dear friend. Welcome to this special video brought to you by GFM United Prayer and Revival Ministry. I'm Evangelist Gabriel Fernandez, and I'm so happy to be with you today. It is another Friday, and last week I started something which is called Generous Friday. And this Friday I'm actually outside the store. I'm actually going to go in and I'm going to pick up something. And then I'm quickly going to drive around on my way to my office. I'm quickly going to drive around and just look for someone to bless. My friend, you know what? Uh, the life of an ordained minister of God, who's also a businessman, is very difficult. And that's why sometimes you can maybe see that I'm a bit tired on my face. But, you know, God is a good God. There's two types of men of God, my friend. There's one who lives completely off donations. And then there's one who's a tent maker, kind of like Apostle Paul. I find myself in the tent makers, in the group of the tent makers. And what does this mean? It means I don't take anything from donations that come in, but I myself also donate towards the ministry. God is such a good God and He wants to bless you, my friend. And He can bless you if you bless others. I've learned a principle in life, my friend, as a businessman and as a man of God. I've been ordained uh, twice in the churches because they wanted to um, uh, confirm my calling. And even before getting ordained, I was still moving in the, the, the whole the gifts of God and the, the move of God because before the ordination happened, I first had an encounter with Jesus. I had an encounter with Jesus and He sent me out. The Bible says, how can one go unless one is sent? So I was sent out and I got ordained. I've learned something in my life as a man of God, as a businessman. When you give, it shall be given unto you. The key to increase in your life is to give. If you want your life to go up, learn to give other people. Learn to bless other people. Look for people who are poor, who are suffering, and help them, and your life will go up. Also, sow into the ministry. Sow into the gospel. This ministry of GFM, it's a good ministry to sow in. There's also other good ministries. But sow, sow, sow. As you sow, you shall also reap in the name of Jesus. And this is what we're doing. Today we're going to look for someone. We're going to sow into their life. Just make their day. It's a bit of a rainy day. As you can see, there's a bit of drops on my window out here. We had a bit of a battle recording outside, but it's fine. We have an indoor place where we record and we got the recording done. But, um, you know, it being a rainy day, sometimes if you're hungry on top of that, it can make it very difficult for you. So hopefully we change that for somebody today. Okay, so we're back here. And this is basically what I've picked up for the people that I'm going to give out today. Um, I'm looking for a family with kids. Uh, I don't know, ever since I, I had my niece or my niece was born, uh, I don't know, every time I see young children, I just have a soft spot for them. So I got some juice over here, got some chips for the young children. And in South Africa, I know this is one of, uh, people really love this. And I got some bread. Uh, there's some other little goodies in there, but this will most probably make someone stay. And um, this is, if I can say, the key to success in life. The key to success is giving, my friends. And as you can see, I'm recording this and I'm showing you this. I'm not showing this to you to get your approval or your, uh, for you to see or to show off to you. No, I'm actually showing you. I'm leading by example. I'm leading by example in this video. And the only reason I'm recording this is to show you that this can be done and to encourage you to do the same. Um, God is such a good God and as you do this in someone else's life you'll see the blessing of God give and it shall be given unto you press down shaken together and running over uh, I just arrived at my office as you can see there's a bit of shade out here um, where we actually just meet up to do the work for business for ministry and everything together and um, I actually just gave out the parcel and I feel so good my friend I feel so good uh, you know, I've been blessing this specific family for a long time, for a long time, and I found them today. You know, surprisingly, I looked around. This is the only family I could find. Today, after blessing them, I could see the man's heart was open, ready to receive the gospel. And I delivered the gospel. Even you, as you bless people around you, remember that you can also deliver the gospel at some stage. Don't just give and then start immediately talking about the gospel, talking about Jesus. Yes, we know, me and you, we know that Jesus is the one who can change lives. But first give, give in love, just keep on giving, give. And then at some stage, the Holy Spirit will minister onto your heart and say, okay, now they're ready to receive the gospel. At that time, deliver the gospel, it'll change someone's life. It will change their life. Let me tell you something. When the Holy Spirit tells you to do something and you do it, 
There is power. I can guarantee you this man that I've blessed today, that I've prayed for, that I've encouraged today, his life will never be the same again. I've seen this happen to so many people. Yes, I might be young and, uh, you know, I've been in ministry not for so long, but in the short time that I've been in ministry, I've seen thousands of miracles. I've seen thousands of of lives changed. I've seen things happen. I've been on TV in 57 countries and I've preached the gospel and I've had testimony after testimony of after testimony. The way it comes to pass is by having a genuine heart after God and following after the leading of the Holy Spirit. This is the best thing that you can do. In saying that, we come to the end of this video and I encourage you, wherever you are, wherever you watch this, do the same for someone else.